Representative Schreiner. Thank you, Mr. Chair. Uh, members of the House, I voted and I strongly urge you guys to push red on this one. Um, I agree with, with all of the good ladies and gentlemen that have spoke before me today. But because the long lines are out there and things were not maybe as organized or whatnot from county to county as they, as they were, do not give us the right to shrink people's ability to register to vote. That's irresponsible. This is a human resource issue. And I can't think of another time when there's a human resource issue, we go out there and we take away people's rights rather than try to fix the, fix the office problem. We could buy more computers. We could go out there and recruit more staff. We could split those lines in half. If there's anything, if there's anything that should implore you to vote no on this, it is those long lines. It's the fact that people stood in those long lines, the fact that people showed up, they found out they weren't registered to vote, and they were willing to wait four hours, get their registration in, and stay in there and cast a vote for a Republican, Democrat, Independent, Green, Red, Red, I don't care, okay? I, I think it's very important that you keep people's rights in mind when you're doing this. Bringing back, even if it's three days, that takes away the right of the guy who realizes, hey, Things didn't go my way. I just found out that my registration card still stuck to my fridge. He follows his voter rights. He fo follows the ability to vote. He wants to be a part of that process. There's no reason to take that away because of a human resource issue. I urge you, urge you to vote red on this.